What's up guys? I'm here at the Etowah River on the spillway. Uh, we're fishing a uh, Georgia kayak fishing bass tournament this weekend. Um, the weather's beautiful. It's really hot outside. Uh, this stretch of river, it was a little bit of an incline to get the boats in and launch and then there's a portage because of this. So we have to take out over here and then come around this little trail and then down. So because of that, because of the accessibility of this river, um, I chose to paddle the uh, Vibe Skipjack 90 today. Smaller boat, lighter weight boat, it's more maneuverable. But Skipjack's been a pretty solid boat. It's stable for its size, it's real wide. It's got a uh, real pronounced edge on both sides. I think that helps out with the stability. It's got four rod holders, which is nice for a small boat. All right guys, Skipjack 90 has two stow hatches. So it's got one locking hatch. Um, it's very waterproof. Right there, you can get the little red net that sets down in there to keep your stuff from sliding into the boat. I like to use 550 ferry cord on the bow. It makes it easy to control the boat. Drag it up an incline or let it down a decline if you have to. Just uh, allows for the maneuverability of the boat instead of having to like hunch over and hold it. Uh, here's the other stow hatch. Right there. Drink holder, mount for a rod. Now it's got the non-framed cushion seat, which has been pretty comfortable. I mean, I've gotten wet on this trip, but it's also 90 degrees outside, so yeah, not a problem. Um, stow compartment back here has been great. I got an offshore angle waterproof bag and then another dry bag inside of it. Um, really easy to secure things back here, guys. It's a uh, you know, nice tight setup. The Skipjack 90 has four handles, one on each side, and then one on the bow. One at the stern. Just makes it easy to carry sideways, you know, carry with two people, carry with four people, kids can carry it, so it's just a very maneuverable boat. And I paddle a Jackson Big Tuna, um, and I've also paddled some other really big boats, and they're just tough to move around once they're out of the water. This skipjack is not, and that's why I chose to paddle in this one today. The big plus here, guys, is on the Etowah, because of the portage, uh, because of the access, it's very advantageous to have a boat that you can just get out of and pick up with one hand and walk around. So, great boat, guys. Great second boat. If you like to fish skinny water, um, creeks, that sort of thing, you know, something small like this is the way to go. So, thanks for checking out the video. I hope you guys like it. If you want a creek boat, guys, the Vibe Skipjack 90 is, is, is a good one to go for.